Hey guys, this is Johnny Rodriguez, and I'm gonna make a video of my reaction of Streets of Rage 4, the Trader, the Trader reveal. Now, of course, as time goes by, there's gonna be more traders. They're gonna show more stuff, but this is the very first trader they made. Looks like Dotemu and Sega are working together on this new version of Streets of Rage, Streets of Rage 4. So. You know, many of us fans thought that they were never going to make a better game, that's out of style, that's CM, boo-hoo. But look like they're finally going to make Streets of Rage 4. And so far, what about what I have seen based on the trader, it looks very, very promising. So I'm going to do a reaction. Obviously, I'm not going to show the footage. Um, I want to avoid copyrights with YouTube and all that. Um, and I'm going to try to keep the volume low so that... The, Again, for the same reason. So, here in the beginning, the, at the cinema of the trader, you see the streets, the buildings. It looks very anime-ish. looks very cool. It looks like the modern type anime you see nowadays. And it looks like Axel now has a beard and a mustache. And a bandana. Totally different looking than how he used to look like in the older games. And then we have Blaze. Looks pretty much the same. And now you see how the game looks like, you know, the people fighting on the streets and all that, like your regular 2D beat em up type game. And then the woman with that snake, I'm not sure, that's probably the new enemy of the game. I'm not sure about that. But it looks pretty cool. It looks very promising and, um, yeah, that's pretty awesome. Uh, based on what I've seen in the game, like when the people are fighting and all that, it looks pretty much like a modern take of like what Capcom did back in the day when they had Street Fighter Alpha and they started to do that whole like characters looking very like anime style. So um, I guess that's the approach they're going for. I'm actually surprised. While the graphics look really good, I'm actually surprised that they went. 2D instead of 3D, because nowadays people want to do 3D. You know, they want to make the characters look as real as possible. You know, 3D-ish in your face, and it looks very... I mean, the graphics look really good, but it looks kind of weird that the game is still like 2D style. But I guess they didn't want to change their approach too much. I think they didn't want to risk it too much because, you know, at this stage, it's like... If they're making Street Rage 4, it has to be pretty good. It has to be... In a familiar style that people are not going to feel like uncomfortable with the with the game, with the concept. So, I don't know. I guess in a way it makes sense why they're going to that whole 2D route. Going back to the old-fashioned like beat em ups format. Uh, but yeah, I can't wait to see the next trader. To see how good the next trader is going to look. This is just the first trader. So, it already looks really awesome. And it already looks really, really promising. So that's it, guys. This is just, you know, it's just me, Johnny Rodriguez, and I just wanted to give you what I thought about the trader, and I think it looks pretty cool. So, um, yeah, um, I'll obviously post another video whenever there's more traders of Street Rage 4 um, to give you my input, and, um, yeah, just keep checking my channel for that. All right, peace.